Hello everybody, this is Havoc. Welcome to part 29 of our Total War Tilla White Huns campaign. Picking up right where we left off. We took out another one of Egypt's little thingies. Uh, settlements. And that was a pretty big battle. Did pretty good. And then uh, we took out Nobatia. Subjugated them. Uh, they are improving. We'll see if they if it's even worth it. I don't even care. This will be a thorn. The Eastern Roman Empire side might delay them a little bit. The Eastern Roman Empire is coming at me with pretty much everything they got as well. One, two, three, four, five full stacks. And it's a lot of troops. We are recovering. Uh, we've, we're pretty run down. But, I think we'll be alright. So we're going to head back down here to Egypt. Adulus. We'll sack that. We're already over here. We sacked um, Udamon. Um, and then we are recovering from there. And once I get my other hordes all together, we are going... I'm going to cross. And we're just going to start pillaging and raising <clears throat> all of their trash. Um, we will eventually come up against them. I'm hoping that maybe I can prevent that from happening. Uh, just through attacking these guys. You know what I mean, man? So, uh, I guess we'll see. So, we're going to go ahead and hit that in turn since at the, it's at the end of the turn. And hope that they don't catch up with me. The plan would be... If we can get some, like, two-on-ones all the time, uh, then that would be very pleasant. So if I could, like, isolate one of the East Roman Empire's armies and have two of my own per one of his, we could probably win. Oh, goodness. They just have so many troops. I would just, I don't want to get ganged up on. <laughs> Go ahead. Do what you must. I'm hoping they'll just go after, uh... Nobasi a little bit. Oh, I think they killed one of my guys. Or they turned him. Oh, dang it, I think they turned him. You suckers. Diplomacy, Don't peace treaty. Each other until I'll do it. I could use four grand. Fund the war effort. So we'll see how that plan works. Ideally, I want the odds to be ever in my favor. They did. They converted one of my guys. You boobs. Critical success. Persuade was a critical success. Natural causes. Illegitimate birth. Failed. That's okay. Uh, Nobatius changed to Greek Christian. That's fine. Um, bum bum. They have desert attrition. Uh, let's hinder this army. Success. Campaign movement range minus 80%. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, we need to go here. I know we have rivalry out the wazoo. But that's okay. Uh, let's, can we, okay, that's fantastic. We will encamp. Oh, should we even fight them? You know what? I'm actually going to retreat. They need to recover. So that's what they're doing. 
Uh, Nobleman's Camp. We could take that. Gives us plus five integrity. Integrity is not an issue. We really need to work on uh, wealth. So I got to five there. So I'm going to try and work on that. Uh, he can't really do much. And neither can he. Royal Host. We can't afford that. Warriors Camp. Man, we need more food. For reals. Okay, so he has 18 out of 20. How, what do you have? You have 18 out of 20. Let's go ahead. I want to know why it's our income so bad. Because we'll lose money quick like that. I'm going to get one of those guys. And... Uh, armor piercing damage. That would be good. Okay, so we're not going to get one of those guys. There we go. And you're at 20 out of 20. Okay, good. Uh, we'll end the turn. <laughs> also, uh, this week, not today, because I'm actually recording this on Sunday, uh, the Make uh, Love Not War, or whatever that, that contest is, um, we are trying to get the newest DLC that's coming out, right? Right? So, that's a lot of troops. Didn't see that coming. Let's retreat. And then if he comes after us again, hopefully be without his reinforcements. Okay. Well, we're going to test and see how well we do against these guys. Da, 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 da. Anyways, whatever that, that thing is that's going on between uh, Total War, uh, Warhammer, and... Um... What the, whatever the other one is. My mind is just drawing a huge blank right now. Uh, I will be doing an hour long hour long specials all week long on my Total War Attilas. So not today because like I said I'm recording on Sunday because I don't have enough time to record them and upload them uh, before I have to go to work. I do have a full time job. So that's how that's going to go. So both of the episodes today on Monday will still only be half an hour. But uh, Mondays or Wednesdays and Fridays will be hour longs. So you'll actually get like four hours. I think that's four and a half total hours this week. Whereas you usually only get an hour and a half. Just as an FYI. And that means we will also play every single battle. Uh, that is part of the the prerequisite, um, obviously. That's why I'm doing an hour long because it will take significantly longer to play every single battle. Come to Papa. Our general is under attack. Where are you out there, General? So many onagers. Uh, we are going to melee. Those guys. Good. We made one of their cav route. We're actually going to retreat our infantry. Making those onagers route too. Okay, so their cav are out of the way. So we're going to focus on their infantry. If 
we can just keep like I want to keep my infantry and they'll be useful once we run out of ammo for those guys Enemy units have been rallied. you know what general you get over here it's perfect for you Meanwhile, we can whittle down the general as well. This may not be too bad. This may not work out too shabbily. This will also this will be very much a factor in whether or not we can take these guys on one v one, or if we're going to need to be up close and personal with uh, two v one armies. How many have I lost so far? We've only lost sixty. These guys are just getting wrecked, too. Uh, let's go ahead and melee and get these uh, mercenary Kurdish archers out of the way. Kill the general. That is crucial. He has to die. There we go. The enemy general is fallen. Good. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Those guys will route. We can bring these guys in now. you're going to come back into your not melee mode get my general in and all this stuff there we go yeah they're going to be they're going to route pretty good Everyone focus on a single target. Maybe we can get some good routes going on there. We will run out of ammo with the majority of my troops. Uh, you know what? Let's actually see if Flaming Shot makes them route quicker. It may do that. They may route a lot faster if we do Flaming Shot. Scooch back. Scooch back. Okay. Three. Two. Four. Route, dudes. Just route. It's not even worth living. What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, you guys. We have gained the upper hand. There we go. Go here. Uh, four. Yeah, you go over there. There we go. Route them up. Okay, so we only lost a couple of hundred, and they lost their whole troop. That'll be the end of the battle, but we will keep pursuing. It's worth it to lose a few more troops to make sure that this army never again sees the light of day. These guys can split off and come here. Very nice. Very, very nice. That gives me a lot of hope. Take down those last guys. Just 
kill him. Just kill him. There we go. Decisive victory. 135. That's how many people we lost. If this is their standard setup, we're golden. They lost 1,802. That's insane. The thing is, he didn't... He didn't die completely. There's still 35 of those guys left. We will take your reinforcements, my friend. And you can suck it, purple. Man, they are after this guy with a vengeance. Oh, they're going to use my own dude against me. Oh, nice try. Nice try. They have so many troops. So many of them. Like I said, if we can split them up and take them out that way, that would be preferable. Like this guy I could probably get, but I'd have to worry about the other five standards they have. Good freaking... Oh, it's so many. They're like the Huns. They're like the regular Huns. It's insane. I guess they are strength number one. They do have the largest territory, which means they'd have the largest economy. Your armies stand at risk. We have troops who could help. That is the thing. Sure. Come on. Let's do it. Enemy killed in battle. Hostile agent activities. There's enough of them. Okay, so I can still move. That's good. We're just going to hinder the army. Failure. Okay. We gotta hinder one of these armies, man. Failure. You guys suck. You guys genuinely suck. Is that all? Thirsty for battle. Can you guys cross? We should be okay. We're going to do it anyways. Yeah, you'll cross in one turn. That's fine. You'll cross in one turn. Okay. So, I'm going to come back here. We should be able to take these guys out. I'm going to take these guys out. And then I'm going to sack it and raise it. Because I'm done. I'm done with it. We need to, to raid a little bit more. Which we will. Uh, once, especially once we get up further north. But I think for these guys down here, since they're pretty recently developed, we might as well just take them out. Sandstorm, we're going to wait. Sandstorm, wait right again. Dry, that works. Um, all of you guys heavy shot army zack here general's back there let's start the battle okay we're just gonna hang out right on that edge the enemy approaches Yes, they do, and they will die. How many guys do they have here? 899. These guys are getting some major, major experience points. I'll tell you that. Flaming the shot. Are losing their advantage. As long as they route, that's all I need them to do this game. We don't need to take them out completely.
Let's scoot back. Ho ho ho! Trying to be shifty. Shifty doesn't work. Okay, go after these scout equites. Please. Please, 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 please. Get wrecked. A little bit of crossfire. A little bit of friendly fire. Oh, but you're dead. You don't exist anymore. Do the same with these guys. Just need to make them rout completely or kill them off completely. Uh, looks like we might kill them off completely. There we go. We're going to come over here. Heavy shot. There's their general. We're going to super fast forward time this because this is pretty much going to be standard. Go, go, go. I'm really going to focus on the infantry. Uh, infantry. Because once they're dead, all we have to do is go melee. And go after these guys. after this guy that's their general once he routes I mean we're losing a few more than I would normally as sieges are all always are a little iffy take him out a unit has fired all of its ammunition. once this guy routes I think we'll be good Once, if, there we go, end the battle. Victory. Lost 157. So like I said, more than normal, we were a little too aggressive, but I needed to get, just get in, get out, so I could raise it. We're going to sack it, and we're definitely going to raise it. Organa, you have leveled up. Good job, sir. Um, ammunition. We're going to do ammunition plus six because we run out every single turn. Melee attack, cunning, missile attack rate plus 10%. I don't know if that's necessary. Is there anything raiding and sacking? Here we go. Raiding income plus 24%. I like it. I like it, I like it, I like it. None of these guys can come close to reaching us. Oh, and we researched something. Oh, sacking income plus 15%. That would be good. I still don't have... I still don't feel comfortable. I only have 17,000. I'm hitting minus 5k per turn. I don't want to do this yet. So... Armor and melee damage. Royal Yurt. I may have to. We were just doing so good money-wise. Let's go tactical formations just for a little bit. We're going to end the turn. And hopefully the Eastern Roman Empire will go all the way down and realize that I'm not even there. And or they'll get distracted by Nobasia. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. That's one, two, three, four, five, six full standards. I know they have one up here. So they've got probably, I would say they probably have a dozen full standards. At least. You know what I mean? Like, that's just insane. And maybe the Huns are pushing on them now. I don't know. 
I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I wish I knew. There you go. Get distracted. That's fine. Because we may even sweep up here and take them back out if we think we can take them on. I mean, there's so many things we could do. So many things. Go away, dude. I'm not going to lie, it's pretty messed up that they're using my own guy against me. And they're going to cross the channel. See, that's another thing. It's like, they shouldn't know. Like, standard, if you want to make it more realistic, make them come all the way down to realize that I'm not there. Don't cross when I cross. You can't see me. You boobs. The generals are all pretty stacked as well. I mean, we're not messing with new recruits here by any means. Come on. Come on. Duty calls Havoc's Fury. Uh-oh. Vegka. Oh, no. Mmm, that sucks. Do we have anyone worth a dang here? We have this guy. No one else really is. We need to get some new dudes into the mix here. He's a marksman. Plus one experience for missile recruits. Oh, oh, he was 79. Okay, well... Well, that sucks. Um, we will just come here. Oh, we can't even encamp then. So we might as well go all the way. Oh yeah, they're completely undefended. Um, let's actually... No, that doesn't give us crap. We're gonna go down this way. I'm going to go after this dude. I'm going to go after him again. Aggressive stance. These guys really need to... Yeah, they've got full standard. We're going to come over here. And we're going to raid. 600 per turn, that's not too bad. Okay, so this guy, Aptaros... He's leveled up. Um, melee 5 damage for infantry. They hardly ever see battle. But that'll work. We need ammunition. And we need... Raiding. Really need to focus on raiding because we're so close. We're at 4,000. I'm almost close enough for... Units. Which we could recruit a couple if we wanted to. But we're not there yet, so. Let's see here. Got a couple more turns with these guys. We're going to just start assassinating their units. We've lost all of our good men. And it ticks me off. Because I can't even recruit right now, can I? I have one army that can recruit. I know I do. Okay. Okay. So we're going to do that. Nope. Here. And here. There we go. In the turn. Let's see what happens. Oh, goodness. This kind of sucks, but... Ah, that's just the cost of being a horde. We just have to be so careful. Like, because if we lose a horde, we don't just lose military units. We lose an economy that we've spent, you know, 29 parts making. So, they're going to haul butt probably to go fight us over there. 
there is an army in the sea, I might mention. Can't forget that. And hopefully no Basia, now that the East Roman Empire is going to leave them alone, maybe they will go to war and take some of these other settlements. That'd be real nice. Egypt. Psh. Do, 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 do. Okay, faction destroyed the Cartley. Natural causes, extra. Illegitimate birth. Atropatine and the Eastern Roman Empire are now at war with each other. Let me use my spies as a means of eyes. Um. Yeah, we're getting closer and closer. Thirsty for battle. Let's be aggressive. 110. Gods be placed. Excitement. Did they sack it? No, they didn't. For the tribe. Oh, uh, we're just going to sit for on it move, for a few turns. Um, I'm actually going to merge a couple of guys together. What do we get from sacking this guy? 500? That'll work. Oh, I moved already. Dang it. That's fine. Not a huge deal. Could we move up here and get closer? We could. So let's do that. Nope, doesn't do anything. Okay, guys, well, that will end the part. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Uh, we will just focus on uh, knocking down the Eastern Roman Empire to the best of our abilities. Um, we're going to go up the coast. I'm going to take this one, obviously. We're pretty much just going to ride the coast, and I'm hoping that we will get such experience these guys are all rank 1. That's another reason why we have the advantage. I mean, I got rank 3s and 2s at the minimum. These guys are up in rank 4s or 5. And down here, I mean, it's the same story. Across the board, we have some very experienced cav that can whittle these guys down before they even know what's going on. So that's what I'm hoping will be the tipping point and the advantage for us. Eastern Roman Empire is still rank number 1. And they will be for a very long time. So if you have any comments or suggestions on uh, my campaign, go ahead and leave them in the comment section down below. I'm also part of a network called Kinsho Network. You guys know about this. I say it a lot, but I like to mention them. Um, if you feel like you need a YouTube partnership, which is, uh, I would highly recommend it. It has helped me grow and has given me access to things that I would not be able to have access to otherwise. There is a reference a uh, affiliate reference link, I guess you could call it, down in the description. Click on that and hit that apply button and they see if we can't get you hooked up. I'm also part of Green Man Gaming. There's a Green Man Gaming link down in the description as well. All these things will always be in the description, just FYI. And uh, if you'll click on that link, it'll send you straight to the site. If you order something, I get a little bit of dough, help fund my YouTube channel. And as well as there's a 20% off discount code that applies relatively site-wide that you can use there. So yeah, we'll keep working on the ERE. Thank you guys for watching. This is Havoc, and I'm out of here. Peace!